Oh, hey. Oh, um, it's not what you're thinking. But um, while you're here, I got something personal to talk to you about. Butt butter, ball grease, nut grease, bag bomb, taint tartar. What is it and why do you need it? Coming right up. All kidding aside on the slang terms for chamois cream, basically what we're talking about is a cream or lotion that you're going to put on to rub spots, sore spots, friction spots, whatever you want to call them, that you're starting to develop uh, down below from riding more and more. Uh, it works out well to uh, alleviate those problems. If you want to avoid getting to that spot to begin with, go to your local bike shop, talk to somebody knowledgeable there, get a good bike fitting, make sure the bike fits you. That's going to help you across the board with all kinds of issues. Bike fitting is going to cost some money, but it's well worth the investment in the long run. Also, a lot of times people think if you get a thicker saddle, a bigger saddle, that's going to help. It's not always the case. It's going to be potentially more pressure spots, and you'll end up with more problems in the long run. A lot of different types of chamois cream out there. There's men's and women's specific. Uh, you're going to have to try them out, see what works best for you. So just be aware of when you're putting it on. Try to avoid those sensitive spots of your body, uh, the intimate parts. Uh, not real hard to put on. Basically, you're going to slather some on your hand. Find those spots that are causing you grief or problems and, and put the cream on there and, and you're good to go. Some people put it directly on the chamois. I prefer to put it directly on my body. Uh, my preference for regular riding, longer rides is DZ Nuts. Uh, if it starts getting into cold weather, wet weather, weather, gritty weather, which is cyclocross season, gravel riding, gravel racing, I'll use Bag Bomb, which is an old farmer's trick. It's used on cows and horses. Works well on humans. Works well as a chamois cream for those conditions that I told you about just a second ago. Just be aware it is thick and sticky, so when you put it on, it's, it's going to get all over the place, and it can potentially stain your shorts or stain your sham, so just be careful with that. One other tip, too, if you start getting into embrocation cream, which is a warming cream uh, that you use on your legs uh, in colder weather, uh, really keep your embrocation cream and your chamois cream in two separate spots. Um, use two separate gloves to put them on, however you want to do it. Uh, you don't really want to ever mix those two up. Uh, other than that, uh, that's all I have. So if you have any comments or, or thoughts, drop those down below and I'll try to answer those questions for you if you have them. Beyond that, I am going to go out and ride my bicycle. Have a good day.